Hello, I'm Dr. Andrea Peterson. And I'm Dr. Eric Mazur. Today our health question is, when is minimally invasive surgery an option for back pain? So, Neil, we've got an expert, an expert in back and neck surgery. When, it's always, I guess, an option, but right. I shouldn't say it's always. But, but when would you do it? What are the indications to actually push through sure. and do that surgery? So uh, I just want to start off saying, usually when we operate for back pain or neck pain, it, it, it's concomitant with either leg or, or uh, arm pain as well, because it's a pinched nerve that we're trying to get the pressure off of. Um, and I think minimally invasive surgery is a new trend that's, that's growing. And it, it doesn't, one surgery isn't minimally invasive versus another. I think the biggest thing is uh, our techniques in trying to spare the soft tissue and not disrupt our musculature so patients recover at a faster rate and obviously less scarring and smaller incisions. Um, so, and I think it's really based upon the patient and their pathology. If you pick the, the right patient and the right pathology and, and do, and do a, a minimally invasive approach, um, I think that they can do well. Do you use minimally invasive approaches when you get into the spinal canal as well? Are you, are you using, trying to cut away less of the, the, the vertebral body lamina? Yeah. I know you could, some people do, you do that. Yeah. Are you trying to move the nerves in a different way than people used to? I think it's more about the, the techniques of getting down there, which are minimally invasive. And obviously when we're down there, we do try to minimize how much bone we take away because we don't want to disrupt the bony architecture of our spine. Um, and then it just comes down to the, the different equipment we have nowadays and, and, and the tools that we can use. Do you, do you look using a microscope or a... a, a, a you know, you can go both ways. You can use a microscope or um, I, I wear loops, so I basically have the microscopes mounted to my lenses. Um, and it, it's usually just surgeon preference. The great news compared to surgery on the neck or back uh, a decade or, or so ago is people are in the hospital less much shorter much shorter yeah. hospitalizations up and moving about yeah. more, more I mean I, I like to have my patients up and moving the day of surgery you know Wonderful. I just did a I did a three level fusion um, uh, two days ago and the patient's going home today that's Thank great you. great Wonderful news news. Thank so, you so much. Thank you so much. Great information. If you have a question you'd like for, for a doctor who'd like to suggest a topic for a future show, we would love to hear from you. Send your questions or comments to health talk at wchn.org. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time on Health Talk.